Hi, today we're going to have a bit of fun with Creator's drag and drop functionality in Smart Objects. I found a nice little model from Google Warehouse. I think you'll recognize him. And I've dropped him into a suitable environment. This Creator Smart Object is already set up for some game functionality. First, we will need to drop some controls onto our little guy. I'm selecting a simple arrow keys controller and a locked navigation to prevent key conflicts. Since we want to watch the action from an overhead view, yet still follow our character, we'll also drop an overhead pan camera smart object onto him. I'll just click the play button, press the arrow keys, and we're up and running. It's that easy. Driving around a large environment this quickly is okay, but it would be a lot more challenging if we had a few obstacles to maneuver around. I put together a collection of useful props to get us started. Once again, we'll just drop them into the scene. Let's try them out. As you can see, there are a few places we can't yet get to. I think we need to add a few more objects so our character can gain access to them. This time, I'll drag in a dynamic smart object. It's already animated and ready to use. I will need to make some adjustments to make sure it is in place to reach the top of the platform. Well, the rising platform will get our little guy to the top, but we'll still need a way to get him onto it. Another low platform would be useful, but it also needs to be accessible. For that, I'll just bring in a large debris pile, position it, and we're ready to test. To round out our environment, I'll drop a few more objects into the scene. Arrange them. Test the result. And when I'm happy with everything, save my file. With a few more steps, we can publish the scene and share it with friends and family. I open the Publish dialog, tell it to use the current scene, make an EXE, and there we go. How cool is that? Coming up next, stuff for our character to do.